G'day, I'm Matt from Bush Tracker, and I'm here to show you in our 19 foot show van for 2024. Let's have a look. So looking up the front of the van, we have a island bed, which is queen width and double length, so that's 1900 long, six foot three. Uh, we've got storage underneath, and then step lockers both side to make it a bit easier to get in. Great spot to put your shoes and all the rest. And uh, we've got lockers both side as well. Uh, with storage in them. Little nooks up the very front as well, so if you've got a, a book or an iPad or something like that, you can throw them in. And then looking rearwards in the van, we've got our kitchen, seating, and the bathroom at the back, which I'll show you soon. So I'll start in the kitchen. You can see we've got plenty of storage underneath, as well as overhead cupboard storage. 32 inch TV mounted to the wall, which can swivel around to the bed when you uh, wanna watch something from there. Uh, we've got the double bin arrangement just under here. If I open that up, you can see that pulls out. We've got double bins. Uh, we've got uh, drawers for your cutlery and all the rest. Uh, and then you've got your sink. This particular one, we've still got gas on board. So we've got a induction and twin gas stove set up. And then a Panasonic convection microwave under, uh, underneath. So that's a four in one. So that's an oven, a steam oven, a microwave and a grill all in one. We've got our seating on this side, cafe dining, and uh, the main table for that is just stored here underneath the bed if you want to use that. Got USB charging, power points, all the rest. Uh, further back, we've got our full height pantry here. So this is a, uh, you've got your pantry on top. So if I open that up, you can see a huge big pantry there. An appliance sort of area underneath. So we've got the coffee machine here that can slide away. And then the pocket door just comes around and can close and then store back away when you when you want to use it. And there's a power point in there as well, so you can plug in your appliances. We've got some drawers underneath as well, so if I open that up, you can see we've got some really deep drawers there as well. Uh, that false panel there goes to outside where there's actually a generator locker. Uh, on the other side, we've got our full height fridge. That's a 188 litre Dometic fridge with a massive big drawer underneath as well. So if I open this door here, this is the door to the bathroom. You can see here, uh, we've got our Ogo composting toilet. We've got uh, plenty of storage in your vanity as well. Uh, washing machine mounted to the wall. And then here in this cupboard as well, we've got more storage uh, behind the mirror. And actually this, this opens up as well and there's even storage in the side. Uh, looking into here, here's the shower. So we've got our shower head there, pointing away from the door. We've actually got storage in both of these cupboards. Uh, so a lot of people will use that for extra linen or towels or whatnot. And then you can see we've actually got a heater outlet in the shower as well. So you can use this as a bit of a drying room. Uh, and as per always, we've got our twin drain outlets so that if the van is slightly out of level, uh, it's not going to affect the, the water draining away. And that's all hand laid fiberglass, no seams, no joints. So coming back out of the bathroom, looking forward in the van. Close that up. All the electronics are up here. So as per the last videos I've done, we've got our Symarine up the top there with uh, showing your battery percentage. We've got our switches here, which can all be controlled from your smartphone as well for your interior lighting, external lighting, all the rest. You've got your stereo, which connects up to the little Bose speakers and a subwoofer as well. Uh, heater control for your diesel heater. Uh, and then this particular van's also got a 3000 watt inverter uh, combined with a 120 amp charger as well. Um, further along, we do have a Cowfish 5G van connect as well, so you've got um, internet uh, and that can also connect to a Starlink integration kit as well So you can pretty much have internet anywhere in Australia Well, that's it for the inside of the van. Uh, thank you again for watching and uh, if you've got any questions feel free to drop us a line uh, and on our website uh, hit the contact us button or um, Give us a phone call. We'd love to show you the van in person. It's uh, it is making its way around to various different shows throughout the year So thanks again for watching. Cheers